Hello friends, welcome to Unity 3D Teacher Tutorial. So this is the third tutorial series of uh, Duitwin plugin. So in this tutorial we are going to see about Duitwin transform rotation. So there will be a two elements we are going to see in that important elements do rotate and do look at. So in the last tutorial we have seen uh, transform for the position. So like this you can able to transform the position like this. So in this push in this tutorial we are going to cover these things between transform rotation so let's create a new scene so new scene and then save scene as do twin transform no rotation So let's create a new script called transform rotation. So now what we are going to do similarly like uh, moment we are going to make one controller. Controller is going to control the area object, try and drop that rotation and open the script. Similarly, like last last video, we are going to in order to use a do twin, we want to import dg dot ini. Okay, and then now let's let's have one game object here, three D object. Okay, so. So we are going to rotate this object using Duitwin system. Okay, so that is a task. So let's create this is called player. So I am going to call in the public reference public game object player. That's it. So after one script has been compiled, go to the controller, try and drop the player over here that's it okay now you can able to fit that player over here in the inside the script so play here since it's a transform you want to have player dot transform dot do rotate search for do rotate okay so in the do rotate we are going to set the position which going to rotate for example I'm uh, so this is a player I want I'm my my plan is to make the rotation on y like this okay so let's create a system called new vector 3 i don't like to change anything so transform dot portion dot x i mean i'm sorry i don't like to change x and y i mean x and z so in the y i'm going to make it as 180 180 means so it's going to rotate 180 180 degree something like that maybe we'll try to have 170 158 158 so similar thing okay so let's make it this two as zero zero okay okay this was fine and y to zero okay by default it been it has been zero so we are written this and the next thing is we are going to type this duration I mean the speed and then the rotation mode I'm going to set rotate mode to fast that's it so this is the syntax so what we are what I done I got the player and set the transform dot rotate to vector 3 of x to 0 and y to 158.8 and z to 0 and speed of the rotation and then rotate mode to very fast okay so let's see how it work hold on for compiling okay so now you can able to see the object is rotating 158 degree axis from the current position if you like to make opposite side just give it negative So 
so you can e even give the speed 0 0.5 f so it will be a little bit faster yeah so if you like to make a little bit slower you can increase the speed I mean you can increase the value it will be a little bit slower okay so like this you can e able to give e even you can tweak the x-axis to 158 okay so in this after you press the play you can able to see in the rotation so it's both the x and y has been reached where we have given or the push or the rotation we have given inside the pulley so this is the sample for uh, i twin go rotate to rotate So next we see next we'll let's we see how to use do look at so do look at okay so similarly we are going to have player dot transform dot do look at there will be a separate element called do look at so search for look at yeah do look at and then similarly new vector 3 and then xyz axis so do look look at is nothing but for example there will be a two object here so so my object is like this I want to move the object and see the object like this so this is the plan so you can look the particular object maybe you can have target so the idea is we want to make the object to look the object so that is the plan so to look in order to look the object in order to look the object here you need to rotate 80 degree from this position so okay so what I'm going to do I'm going to write 180 and 0 okay and then speed and then axis dot constant dot which axis you like to rotate and then vector 3 dot 0 this is nothing but uh, just leave it this thing so axis like this particular axis you like to move either x or y or z so it's your choice I like to rotate x okay let's see how it work So it's trying to rotate this portion depending upon the axis which we have given. So it's rotating on X. You can try none also. In this way you can write the things you can change the x-axis like this so even you can be able to target the particular object so before that let me uh, let me try to rotate on uh, some other location maybe so uh, what I'll do I'll just create one more object called target so target dot transform
so we given all the three axes of a target so drag and drop the target over here so let's see how it work so it will look at the target perfectly so let me move the target little bit upside let's see how it look like so it will turn and look directly to the target so let me move some other place so in this way it's look the target on the particular axis you can filter out the axis also i am going to rotate only y so axis dot constraint dot y it's not going to do x and z so one it's you can see able to see only y has been rotated see after it play the y has been rotated okay if you like to rotate x you can write access comments dot x i mean x okay so if it given none everything every axis will be rotated so that's it so, so in this way you can able to rotate and look the object uh, particular object easily so that's it so this is it if you think this video is very helpful for you so please subscribe us uh, i'll see in next video in the next video we will continue with uh, UA system using Vfin plugin. So we'll see you on next video. Thanks and bye.